All right, guys, that's it. End of an era. It's all packed away. It's all gone. All right, well, we made it. We've now traveled from England in the United Kingdom to the island here. We're just filling in the last bits of our paperwork uh, and we will be residents. So I'll tell you about that in a moment. I'll also tell you about the journey, um, the, the house here, and then the new studio setup, which I did a time lapse. It took me 10 hours, which was ridiculously exhausting. Um, I need to get back into the, the gym and exercising more because I was exhausted after building this uh, out for 10 hours. And then I'm gonna tell you about what we're gonna do next week, starting from, I think, Tuesday. Uh, the channel will go to what I talked about before, so shorter videos during the week. And then uh, the, the bigger production, maybe a couple of times a month on a Sunday. So we've got all that to look forward to. But just this week, today, this video is coming out on Friday onto YouTube. I'll then do a, a bigger video for the private community. I'll show you the time lapse of the studio, doing all of that, a little tour of the house and everything like that. And then tomorrow is the coaching. We've got some, some other stuff for the private community. Sunday is the monthly Q&A, so make sure to be on that. It'll be a live stream, so the monthly Q&A. Monday is mentoring day, it's gonna be crazy. And then Tuesday, we're gonna start the new video. So make sure to give me feedback on all of that. But with that said, let me tell you about this move. So we have moved to, some of you guessed it correctly, the Isle of Man, which, a lot of people have, have no idea this island even exists. It's very, very small. Only 80,000 people live here and people are very kind of spread out on the island. So um, it's more like a very, very rural feel to me. And then you have the main city or town, should I say, here called Douglas. And that's a little bit more built up. Uh, but the island is beautiful. We've only explored maybe 20% of it so far. And already we've just fallen in love with the place. Uh, we got a hotel on the first night that was just a stunning hotel. All right, this is where we're going to stay for the first night, just while we wait for our furniture to be delivered. Otherwise, we'd be sleeping on the floor. Yeah, look at this. This is pretty nice, isn't it? And because there's no tourists at the moment, it was really cheap for this room. I was very surprised. It's got a desk and it's got a nice bathroom as well and a shower beautiful evening meal, beautiful breakfast. It was so nice. Uh, let me actually put the, the sunrise actually onto the video here so you can see the sunrise. Okay, look at that for a sunrise. Yeah, good morning, beautiful. So the area that we've moved to, we've actually rented this house that you can see behind me here. We've rented this house for a year because it is so, so difficult to actually get onto the island and buy a property or, or anything like that. And this took months, as, as you know, those of you who are, who are following the story here, this took months just to get this house. We're so grateful to the landlords who let us rent this property because getting a large property, you're talking four bedrooms or more on the island, is extremely, extremely difficult. There were 30 people lined up to view this and my wife and I, <laughs> pulled some strings, I guess you could say, uh, to get the house first before everyone came to view. So we're really just so blessed that we've got this house. We're so grateful for the house. It's got so much space for, you know, lounge and studios for both of us, offices for both of us. So we just really love the house. We're so grateful for it. Uh, but let me tell you about the journey getting over here because that was a little bit more complicated. So what we had to do was pack up the house the week prior to the end of January. The moving company came from the Isle of Man, they got the ferry over and then they arrived on the 31st. They packed up the house on the 31st and I don't think it was too difficult to pack up because we're quite minimalistic. So they packed it up, they then went north to, I don't know, Liverpool I think it was. So the Liverpool ferry is closed for the winter, so there's only one other ferry which is north in Hayes I think it is. So we then had to drive north all the way to Hayes and get the ferry. Now, funny story with the ferry, actually. Someone said to me, Neil, whatever you do, because it was there was a big storm at the time, do not get up and go to the bathroom during the ferry. Like, you know, do not drink any water beforehand, dehydrate yourself a little bit, because you do not want to go to the bathroom on the ferry with this storm. So accidentally, I wasn't thinking, I drank a load of water just before getting on, 
And um, let's just say I haven't got my sea legs. So I was all over the place going to the bathroom. When I came back, I felt so sick and just lay down <laughs> for the rest of the trip. So if you're coming across in a storm, do not walk around. Um, so yeah, crazy. But I wasn't, I wasn't sick, so yeah, there we go. And the other really interesting thing when we arrived, just to show you the very different um, way of life here, everything was closed. You know, we were looking for cafes or anywhere we could get some breakfast at 6.30, 7 o'clock. Nothing at all. So we got the overnight ferry, by the way, just because of the timing of everything. So we had to get the ferry from 2 a.m. to 6 a.m. We couldn't get any other option in order to make it work with the movers and get getting the keys and, and everything else. So the moving company then arrived on the 2nd of February and unloaded. And then I straight away got, got going with setting up the studio, setting up the house a little bit. So it's still a complete mess and boxes everywhere, but we're making pretty good progress on it. Okay, so let me show you the studio real quick then, and then we'll wrap up this video because I've got to make the monthly investment video for the Patreon, which is going to take me the rest of the day. It's usually an hour long, and it is extremely volatile markets at the moment, especially just look what happened with Facebook, and look what happened with Spotify. Again, this shouldn't come as a surprise to any of you. I talked about this a couple of months ago, how these sort of um, companies are overvalued. Uh, let me just give you one quick tip. Anything that exploded up in price during the uh, lockdowns, like Netflix and Facebook and Peloton and all these things, these are companies that did well during lockdowns. But when you come out of the lockdowns, they're not gonna continue going up. In, in my opinion, they were, they were priced a little bit overvalued for the lockdowns. Coming out of the lockdowns now, they're obviously massively undervalued. The price has got to correct back to the normal world we're, we're moving back into. So just be careful with those. I'll, I'll talk about that um, on the, the, the main video today anyway. Wow, look at these markets today. Isn't that crazy? Look at that. Spotify down almost 17%. Amazon down almost 8%. Told you this was going to happen as we go towards March. Remember that video. Watch it back if you haven't seen it. Everything is playing out as we talked about. All right, let's show you the studio then. And if you're wondering why I've got this brown paper on the window with a bit of blue tack, people in the coaching know <laughs> and the Patreon know I get distracted so easily. Uh, so I have to put the paper on there. Well, here we go then. This is so far the studio. In fact, let me come in here. Uh, let me show you this angle. So we've got main camera there, secondary camera there third camera there we got the light boxes you can see what it looks like not quite finished but we're almost almost there now okay and this is the view from the bedroom window then as you can see we've got these beautiful beautiful rolling hills in the background what some people said are the, the mountains i would just consider them really big hills to be honest but we have these be just beautiful views all around the house so much countryside just so beautiful all right, I hope you enjoyed the tour here then, a little update video. But other than that, I'll see you on Sunday for the monthly live stream, the big Q&A session. You can still get your questions in now. You've got time over on Patreon, tier three upwards. Apart from that, see you on Tuesday where we'll start doing the shorter daily videos, Tuesday, Wednesday, I don't know, maybe one Thursday or Friday. Uh, and other than that, I'll see you very soon. Take care.